everyone welcome to my channel this is Sarah once more uh, today I will be talking about how to get a t-shirt maybe the t-shirt you don't want to choose how to get it and make a measurement on the t-shirt this measurement is especially for your hair to know how your hair grows from one inch to, to, to second inch to just like that so I'm going to show you the tools you will be needing. So, you will be needing a cardboard. This is the cardboard. I will tell you what you use this for. You will need this to get uh, the dots on the t-shirt. You will need uh, a scissors. You will need a um, crayon. You will need your ruler. And finally, you will be needing uh, tip room. and what you'll be needing again is patient so let me show you what this is for this one especially is to put underneath the t-shirts I have the bigger one here I have the bigger one here why because uh, for you to make sure it doesn't move to make it stable that is why you need this under the tail and what I do is what I do is I take the tape rule I took the tape rule and I measure from the neck of the tape rule to this place and I took off three inches off then I started the dot from here just like that, one inch, one inch to the bottom where I would want my goal to be. So this is what I did with this. Then, why you will be needing this? Why you'll be needing this is for you to get here to here. This taper, um, this salad, um, taper, sorry, it's thirty. And it's 31 to 30 and what you do is you take 15 then when you had a dot here another dot here so you can easily rule from here to here to make it more easier for you so I've not finished anyway so I'm gonna finish up now so stay tuned and be patient because all you need now is just patience so this is it this is what i did i started <coughs> rolling from here to here which is 15 15 that is 30 of this okay so we roll so it will not move it will be stable this is what i did i started taking it just like this now it's much more easier for me to rule through because I have my dots on both here and here so it's easier for me to to rule so we rule so taking measurements of t-shirt it's much more easier instead of you to use this and start measuring your hair you wouldn't get the real measurement you need all you need is just old t-shirt just old t-shirt like a uh, ladies t-shirt or your guys t-shirt is still okay that would do so what I did here is just a see-through so you guys will be able to get what length you want to achieve you might be uh, natural you might be natural you might not be natural it doesn't matter all that matter is just for you to get what I am doing so I have like two more to go okay there and there I'm getting it right because you know that's why I said you need this 
you need this to protect it for you, for it not to move, because if it moves, you make a mistake getting the two side dots. So, I'm going to finish up very soon, and that's why I said all you need is just patience. All you need is just patience. So, what I did was just, I think I did 22. Okay, now, we go to the side. Okay, I have made a measurement of this side one inch down and I'm going to rule from here I'm going to rule from I'm going to rule from here to here to get one inch from the dot so all you need is patience because you can't just get it the way you want it to be because okay that's why I said you need a, a ruler to rule through. So, this is another tutorial that will help you so much and you kind of enjoyed it. So now I have finished ruling everything. So what I'll do now is to make one inch. I'm gonna write one, two, three, four, five, F, till down. Okay. Now this is one. This is two. This is three. Just like that. So you get what I'm talking about. This is seven, and eight, and nine. Very, very important. Because if you can't get it, then you have to look for another teacher and get the measurement 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 and 21 now I made 21 inches okay now I made 21 inches you can see one two three just down to 21 inches so i am trying to make this to make it my own goal so if you have any question please feel feel free and and make a comment this is the way you can make your own measurement for your t-shirts when you wear them you get the measurement if no one can help you out especially <laughs> my hands are just rough especially you can get someone to when you put it on you can get someone to measure from your bra strap just like that but i just did it this way to make it much more easier for me so if you have okay all right if you have any question please feel free to ask because right right now i'm just waiting for my hair finity so i can start making progress on it that's why i'm making this now so when it comes as my hair grows then i'll be using this t-shirt so feel free to ask any question then i'll be happy to receive them so now right now this is just the cardboard this is the cardboard that i placed under it to make it much more easier for me too so now i'm going to put it on I'm going to put it on and see how it looks like at my back. This is the way it looks like on my back. So it will be much more easier for me to make uh, my length check with my hair. Now my hair is just at my neck or my neck. So I'm going to make a length check. Maybe within six months I'll be having... Uh, maybe six or seven inches depends so this is the t-shirt so you just grab one t-shirt and make it uh, draw on measure so have a nice day bye bye